Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. You're gonna be so excited today because you guys love ab workouts. And today is not just an ab workout, it is an ab challenge. Oh yes, yeah, so if you're not already subscribed, make sure you do. I'm here in the Maldives. I also have a vlog channel so you guys can see exactly what happens and it's pretty hilarious behind the scenes. So make sure you check out my vlog channel too. All the details in the description below. So you guys, you wanna have some abs? Well, I've gotta tell you, first of all, 80% is nutrition and 20% is the fitness. So if you do not have the right nutrition, we got you covered as there as well. So we're gonna be doing a plank ab challenge. Oh yes, yeah, so we're gonna go right down to the ground because that is where you're gonna be with me for the next 10 minutes. Oh yes, you guys are not going anywhere. I have got you, your schedule is blocked off. You've got 10 minutes with me. Okay, so we're gonna start off nice and simple into our plank. So first of all, let's teach you guys how to do one properly. Most of you guys know, but you're gonna have your hands flat on the floor, okay? We're gonna go start on our knees to begin with, and you're gonna pull your belly button in towards the spine, and those elbows are directly underneath your shoulders, okay? Now we're gonna come up onto our toes. Now, you really wanna make sure that your head is in line with your butt, that's in line with your heels. So you don't want your butt up here, you don't want it kind of sagging down. So maybe just take a look in the middle, in the middle, in the mirror, and make sure that you've got that posture right, okay? So pulling that belly button in towards the spine, and we're just gonna hold here. That's it, squeeze, and you're gonna hold as long as you can. If you need to take a rest, all you're gonna do is drop down to those knees, take a moment, and then pop back up again, that's it. So this is for everybody, okay? So it's not gonna be too hard for you, it's not gonna be too easy, because there's modifications for everybody. So we're gonna hold here. We've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, come down to those knees. If you're on your knees already, no problem. Pull that belly button into the spine. Try and open up that chest and just look a little bit further in front of you. Okay, we're holding it here. That's it, we're gonna go into our second set. And I really, really advise you guys to keep on with this video. It doesn't matter if the first time you're like, I can't even do this once through. You've got to keep going and that's how you're gonna see improvements. Okay, so let's pop up again and squeeze. Okay, so squeeze those glutes. Really pull that belly button in towards the spine. Try and open that chest. Give me a smile. I know you want to. I know you're probably screaming at me saying, I hate you, Rebecca, this hurts so much and I can feel the burn, but you are gonna love me afterwards. Okay, so let's just hold it here. We've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's keep holding it there. You've got one more set of 10 seconds. That's it, really pull that belly button in towards the spine, open up that chest, and let's count down with me. For three, two, one. Okay, drop down to those knees. We're gonna stretch out, so arms out in front. Just lift up that chest. Bring those arms underneath your armpit and then lift all the way up. Oh yes, you guys are gonna feel so good after you've done this workout, okay? So next, you're gonna put your hands directly underneath your shoulders, and we're gonna have nice straight arms, so a different kind of plank here. So we're gonna come up all the way up onto our toes. So that's it, so you're just gonna hold nice and strong here. So sometimes people say, you know, their wrists are hurting. If you have a slight bend in those hands, it's just gonna take a little bit of pressure off, okay? So really make sure that you're no, not leaning back here, you've got everything straight ahead. Okay, that's it. And you're gonna squeeze. Pull that belly button in towards the spine. If you need to, you can come down to your knees. If not, you can stay up onto those toes. So that's it, so pull your belly button in towards the spine. Take a look out in front. Oh yes, it's gonna be so good, guys. Okay, now I want you to lift your hips up into the sky and rock it forwards and backwards. So hips up to the sky, back into that high plank. And as you push back down, make sure that you're squeezing those glutes and that belly button is pulled up. Lift up to the top, really push down. That's your moment to breathe. And let's squeeze. Keep it going, guys. Rocking forwards and backwards. Push all the way and into those hands. And you're gonna hold here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And release those knees and let's just stretch out those arms because we are also getting a great shoulder and arm workout in here as well. We are working those abs, but we are working those arms as well. Okay, so this time you're gonna put your uh, fists together. Okay, we're gonna come up into that high plank. Okay, get nice and comfortable. If you want to, you can come down to your knees. More advanced, you're gonna come up here and we're gonna rock forwards and backwards. Oh yes, just nice and gentle, really waking up those abs, waking up those lower abs. If you've got bad knees, you can have a slight bend in those knees as well. You've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, 
three, two, one, and hold. Put those hands flat. That's it, pull that belly button in towards the spine. Really squeeze those abs for five, four, three, two, one. And knees gently down. You're gonna roll all the way onto your back and we're just gonna stretch out. So lift all the way up. Take a nice big breath in. Enjoy this moment because it's not gonna last forever. And then we're gonna rock all the way up and come back over onto your front. So get a little bit of a, a rest there. So same again, we're gonna uh, fist, have those fists. And this time we're gonna drop those hips down side to side. So waking up those oblique muscles. Oh yes, nice and gentle. Now, modified version on your knees, you can do the same. And what I suggest that you do is you just give it a shot. You just come up onto those toes and you just, oh, just do one or two, however many that you can and keep pushing for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax down, hands underneath that chest, and lift up. Oh my goodness, my shoulders, my abs, everything is on fire. We're gonna come over onto the side and do some of those side oblique stuff that you guys absolutely love, okay? So you're gonna start off onto your knees, and all you're gonna do is drop down and lift up. So my elbow is directly underneath my shoulder, so make sure that yours are too. My hips are on top of each other, knees are together. I'm just pushing my hips up and down to the sky. So that's it. So each time I'm doing it, I'm really engaging this core muscle here. So squeeze. Let's go guys. You've got this. Keep using those oblique muscles and lift up for five, four, three, two, and one, lift it up at the top. Can you hold here? Really squeeze those obliques, touch your obliques. They are working, they are on fire. You can feel them moving, okay? You can feel them nice and tight. Oh yes, guys, look, we've only got four minutes left. This is absolutely killing it. Three, two, one. Okay, let's take it over onto the other side. We are working those obliques nice and strong. So come up onto your side, remember that position, hips on top of each other, and we're just dipping up and down. Oh yes, guys, come on, four minutes is nothing. Absolutely no time at all. What are you gonna do? You're either gonna scroll on your phone, you're either just gonna potter around your house, or you're gonna stay with me and get those results. Let's go. Keep pulsing up. Lift those obliques higher up to the sky. Really use those muscles. And three, two, and one. Now lift up, hold it up here. Squeeze those obliques. Now give them a feel. Can you feel them in there? Yes. If you can't feel them, then don't worry, they are in there. Just need a little bit of help on that nutrition and keep on working. Hold it here for three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna take it back over to the other side. Now, if you wanna stay on your knees, no problem. Those of you who want to try the next level, you can have your feet on top of each other and you're just gonna lift all the way up to the top. So that's it, so we're doing a side plank here and we're going to drop down and lift all the way up to the top. So down and lift. Squeeze those obliques. Oh yes, guys, we are doing so great. You can feel those abs working. Try not go all the way back, otherwise you're gonna end up falling into the ocean. Okay, and three, and two, and one all the way. And last, on the other side. Let's get that hand directly underneath the shoulder. We're gonna pop up onto those feet. So that's it, get nice and comfortable, those hips on top of each other, and down we go. We're really squeezing. Look up at that top hand. Make sure it doesn't go past that line of sight. You want it to be straight up in the air. Oh yes, guys, come on. Who wants those abs? Raise your hands if you want those abs. Yes, I do. Yes, let's keep squeezing. We've got five, four. Make these ones your best ones, guys. Three, two, and one. And slowly drop it down. You're gonna come all the way back onto your front where we started in that plank. So hands directly in front of you, on those elbows. Let's everybody try and get on those toes if you can. And we are just gonna hold here. So that's it, so squeeze, pull that belly button in towards the spine, a nice long head, and just wiggle those fingers. We've got this, we're gonna go forwards. That's it, just wake up those abs a little bit more so that everything is on fire. Yes, guys, come on, keep pulsing with me. Keep working, how much do you want it? Keep squeezing for three, two, and one. Now hold here. If you need to come down to your knees, no problem. If you want to stay up onto your toes, even stronger. One minute to go. Let's hold here, guys. We're going to drop to the side for 10 seconds. That's it. 
really use those hips. Keep the top part of the body nice and still where your shoulders are. And we're just gonna keep rotating. For three, two, one. Now push all the way up to the top. Hold that plank nice and high and into that downward dog, up to the top. Last set of exercises, guys. You can make this happen. It's gonna work when you work. That really is the motto. When you are doing the work, that work is gonna pay off. Okay, we're gonna hold up here for the last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop down to your knees. Let's just stretch, one little stretch out. And remember guys, if you are part of the 30 day get fit plan, then all of the warm up videos and cool down videos are exclusive on there. And it's gonna give you a 45 minute full workout, the right warm up and cool down video for each set of videos, okay? So if you wanna do abs one day, it's gonna have it all there ready for you to go. Make sure you go check out that. There's also recipes and more fun stuff. My name's Rebecca Louise. If you've got any requests for videos, make sure you drop in the comment below. Hope your abs are on fire and I'll see you guys on the next workout. Bye-bye.